to another tutorial by COD Mapper on my YouTube page, COD Radiant. Please like and subscribe for upcoming tutorials. This tutorial I'm going to cover how to implement water into your level and how to change it up a little bit, add some extra things to it. Alright, so let's go ahead and draw a brush with any texture. Go to patch, simple terrain patch, 2x2. Two two. Alright, now let's go to textures, surface type, and water. And here's all the water textures. This is sort of trial and error to see what each water texture looks like. You have to go in game, look at it, and see how, how it looks or change it when we get back into Radiant. Let's go ahead and pick Water Dynamic, making for right now. Now, to edit it, to change it up, we, well, let's hit V and select all the vertices and hit G. Here you can change the alpha and the color of it. So let's go ahead and make it, to make it clear, or more transparent, you just move this right here. Zero would be all the way in. 255 would be not blended at all. Just bring it about right there. Now it may get semi-transparent. All right. So then now let's edit color. Let's make it a light blue. All right. That that would make it bluish in game. Go in game, see how it looks. And if it doesn't look quite right, come back and radiate and edit it a bit more. All right. Oh, now you can go to a texture like water making, and if you notice, the alpha quite doesn't work, right? So let's not do that. Let's just use water dynamic for alpha blending. You can still change the color of this type of water, though. All right. Let's say if you play the games and you see how the water um, moves like a stream, and you're not quite sure how to do that, I'm gonna show this here. So let's go ahead and hit V again. Control Shift A to split it or add vertices directly in between it, and then keep on adding on like this. All right, now hit Natural. Make sure you hit Natural. All right, here we're gonna make it. Uh, hit this right here. The cycle edges direction on terrain quads, and make it look like arrows, like his arrows going. That will be the flow of your stream. All right. Oh, you can hit V and Alt left click move these around make it so it looks more like a stream All right. you can still um, change the color and whatnot of it alright so you want to hit natural make sure you hit natural and then do vertical or horizontal stretches until you think it'll look right go in the game and stretch it a bit more if it doesn't look right but I usually stretch it a good amount to make it look normal All right. that'll be fine alright and then hit yeah, don't hit natural again, but hit natural first and stretch it, and then you're done. That'll move like a stream. You can move it down to like this, however you want. Alright. Yeah, I usually stretch it on things that aren't streams, too. Just just because it looks a lot better in game. Alright. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for upcoming tutorials.